So right now we're gonna play around with the OCR tool in Kami. And I didn't know what OCR stood for. I had to look it up, optical character recognition tool. So what this is going to do, it's going to take a PDF document and actually change it so that it's not reading it as like a picture of text, but you're gonna be able to actually change the text. And a lot of teachers want that because they have a lot of developed curriculum that may be in PDF form, but they don't want to retype everything out. This is going to be that option where teachers, you don't have to retype anything out. Thank you. So let's see if it works. I'm going to go to camiapp.com and I'm going to sign into my account. And once I'm signed in, really you're just going to pick the email address that you're going to use. I use sign in with Google. So I'm gonna open up a scanned document from my Google Drive. Now the whole idea of a scanned document is this is a picture basically that was taken of this document. So I'm not able to go ahead and use my dictionary tool and try to highlight or go over the top of any of the text. And so right here you can see, it seems like you have a scanned PDF. Do you wanna try running the OCR tool? This is what we're gonna try. If you can't find it, it is in the menu here, OCR for scan PDFs. So Kami automatically recognizes that, hey, you have a scanned sheet. Do you want to have the text able to be read? So I'm gonna hit run OCR and you're gonna see it work at the bottom. And it's complete. And let's see if we're able to go ahead and interact with it now. Look at this. There's no definition found for that. Let's go ahead if I wanted to. There it is. Highlight the word worksheet. A paper listing question to ask for students. How cool is that? So it took exactly what was on this picture and now we're able to interact with it. If we needed it for text to speech, so students that needed something read to them, you could go ahead and highlight exactly what you want read. And if I highlight this sentence. With the engine off, describe how the brake pedal should feel when pressed. We couldn't do that before when we took a picture, and now we can. Students could take a text box and answer it. What an amazing tool that's part of Canva.